data below and provide the report of Likert scale data. So, five participants tried the three new flavors of milk tea and spilled tea. They were asked to rate each flavor with very satisfied, satisfied, neutral, unsatisfied, and very unsatisfied. So, this is the following data set. Let us now go to our Google Sheet. We have five steps. So, the first step is to provide the data. Second step, second step is to count blank and non-blank responses. How do we count the non-blank responses? We have equal, count A. And then the range. Our range here is from F81 until F85. Okay? So we just have to drag this da to the right. Next, to count the blanks, we have equal count blank. And then the range. Our range again is from F81 until F85. Close parenthesis, enter, and drag it to the right. Next, we have to find the sum of non-blank and blanks from the responses in our data. So we have equal sign, sum, the cell where our non-blank is, and then until blank. Okay, and then drag it again to the right. So it should be all fives. Step 3, count all the feedback from the data set. So we have equal sign count if and then from F81 until F85. So we have F dollar 81 until F dollar 85. Okay, and then comma, we have dollar sign and then E96. Since very unsatisfied is at cell E96. E96 and then enter. So, let's try the autofill but let us recheck. We have F81 until F85, E97. So, it is correct. But, the total should not be dragged down. Okay, let us drag this one to the right and then drag it down. Okay. Drag it until very satisfied only. And then let's find the sum of these responses. We have equal sum and then our range. Range again here is from F96 until F100. So we have a total of four responses. Let us check in our data. Correct, we have only four responses for flavor one from our five participants. So we have to drag this one to the right. We have four, four, and five. Now to calculate the percentage of each feedback, we have equal sign the cell here over F dollar 101. Okay, F dollar 101. So we have 0%. Since we have 0 over 4, that is automatically 0. We have we can drag this one down. Let's check. Okay, correct. Unsatisfied. This one neutral. Satisfied and very satisfied. Again, we can drag this to the right and then we can drag it down. You can constantly check to confirm whether or not dragging the formula will do you good. Kung tatama ba yung lalabas. And then afterwards, we just have to compute for the sum of the ranges here. So sum from F104 until F108. And then just enter that one. It should be a 100%. Same with the last two columns. They should all be a 100%. The last step is to copy the data here, very satisfied, and then paste it somewhere that is not in your table. Paste special values only. 
and then again we have to copy paste special and then transpose do it to the other responses let's have the unsatisfied paste special values only copy again and then paste special transpose just keep on doing it with the other responses Okay, let's have the satisfied response. Copy, paste special values only. Copy again, paste special, and then transpose. Last one, we have the very satisfied response. Copy this one, paste special values only. Copy again, paste special, and then transpose. Okay, this time, we just have to convert the data into percent. And then reduce it so that we will have a whole number percentage, center the text, and then add borders. So the data or analysis of scale provides us with this final table. We just have to copy this one in your answer sheet and then that's it. That is our Likert scale analysis for item number 7. Let's just do a screenshot. Okay. Insert image. Upload from computer. We can find it in our desktop. Okay. So that's our data analysis of the Likert scale. Given the responses, very unsatisfied, satisfied, neutral, satisfied, and very satisfied regarding the three flavors of milk tea from the shop, spill the tea. Okay, so that's it everyone.